Welcome back to what's new in UVM 1.2. Today we're gonna cover a new type def introduced in UVM 1.2 called uh, UVM Integral T. And uh, just to give a brief background, previously uh, the main type def that was being used uh, was UVM bits, Bitstream T and it is 4 kilobits while uh, the UVM Integral T is 64 bits. So this is largely a performance improvement. So just, just to be more specific about uh, what happened here is now the, some of the uh, common methods uh, in UVM component um, have, have these methods that uh, use UVM integral T as opposed to bitstream. So this is largely a performance improvement so that they don't have to use the, this large, large amount of memory. For these operations. Specifically the ones that improved was uh, the, the UVM printer um, has now print field int and, and the UVM recorder which now has uh, record field int. There, there did exist similar methods already for UVM compare, UVM packer, but these previously um, they used logic uh, while the UVM integral T is signed logic. So this is a small change uh, just so you're aware. So this will largely be, um, for most people, it's largely going to be an unseen change. It's going to be basically a performance improvement, especially for these methods, because they will be automatically used um, when the framework detects that your data type uh, is 64 bits or smaller. Now in this example, I simply demonstrate their usage. Uh, specifically, I do the demonstration for the printer. So here, um, by default, there's no print in this component, but uh, do print function is overwritten, and here we do the print field int. This is for the smaller 64 bit or uh, or smaller integer. And um, previously there was a print int, which is still available but not documented anymore. Uh, the correct method to use is print field for you for printing the large int, which is going to be uh, using the UVM bitstream type. Uh, now, unfortunately, in order to set uh, set these guys, in this case, I have uh, my int and my large int. Uh, you would still need to use uh, the UVM bitstream t type, which is which is the way you would set them. Uh, so you know that that still hasn't changed. So this is basically a, a small demo here. So I'm going to, just going to go ahead and run this uh, for demonstration purposes, and we're going to see um, in this example. We just do a print here, and we're going to see uh, these values being printed out. 